evening, guys and girls. Hope you're um. Hope you're well. Another week, another little project. Uh, well, there you got it. Oh, you can't see that, can you, silly boy? There you go. A very off, not really round. It's another one of those ones that I did two or three years, two years ago. A bit like an egg. We're gonna make, yes, we're gonna do a bowl. But, the difference. I'm thinking about doing a bit of carving and that around the outside there, and a bit of color. But we'll see how we progress. Uh, with it. It's not very clear. Let's have a look and see. Why is that not clear? Ah. That's a bit better, isn't it? Put some lights on. I told you it's going to be a long week. Right, so that, that's the idea. So shove that on now. Shove him on there. Just misses the chuck. Tighten him up. Oh. Take him forward. Oh, not far out. <laughs> not far out. Look at that. Oh my god. So hopefully we can get that round. Most important is get that round. Well, I had to uh, stop here. As you can see, it's so windy out. The camera's vibrating, shaking all over the place. So uh, cut this bit out and we'll rejoin you later. Right, so... Um two days later and uh, the wind has dropped and gone a little bit of sunshine today but uh, yeah we've got to try and make this rugby ball shape into a round shape it's, uh, yeah we'll give it a go Um, yes. How are we doing? Oh, wobbly, wibbly, wobbly. Okay. Yeah, about just on a thousand. Um, my oh, Simon Pope one. Let me see if we can just attack it this way. Being careful towards the end then. Right, see how we're doing. Marks, a couple more than a dozen. 
Too bad, let's just get that bit of pop tear out there, which I can get rid of. Hopefully, can just see it actually. Do a little bit there, a little bit tear out there. A little bit there as well. <coughs> I want it to be. Turn that heater off now. I don't need that on. That's it. Right, that's it. So we've got a little ridge in there. Just to stop me, uh, just in case I don't get it in the right place, it just stop me from going back and ruining it let's see if I can get um, where am I uh, you want side don't you really I knew it was there somewhere. Right. have a lot of um, success going across the bottom here with this uh, ball gouge. I'll get there in the end. Simon Hope, negative brake scraper. Have to set it up on center. And it's just that little bit in the corner I can't get. So we'll uh, get the this one.
Let's see what type of feels good. Yep, it doesn't feel too bad. The exciting bit, bit of sand here. Well, I won't bore you with this. Nobody wants to see sand in, do they? I don't like doing it, let alone you watching it. Okay, well that's the sanding done. Outside I've taken up to 400. Inside the same. But we're going to obviously finish the inside normal. Um, I don't know if they do that now. I'll do it later. Uh, hmm. Decisions, decisions. Uh, I think I might do it now, actually. Why not indeed? Um, a bit of methylated spirits on it, just clean it out a bit. I do think. Look that now. Don't waste it. <laughs> Only one little bit anyway. Put that over there because I've now got a habit of knocking things over. That's it. Let's get that clean out there. Yeah. 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 One little bit going to bin outside, not inside. Right, let that go away. <coughs> and we'll put a bit of a let's uh, dry it off. Put, put, put a bit of warmth in it and dry it off. Good old Hampshire sheen. <coughs> yeah. Let that dry off a little bit. Actual fact. Yeah. Look at that. <coughs> Stop bending down, Barry. Doesn't do you any good. Give it a little bit of a burnish. Yeah. Right, so let's wax on. Give it another one of that, which is the Hampshire Sheen Gloss. Just a little, you need a lot. Lid on. <coughs> Keep 
grabbing it in. It starts to pull on, pull on the cloth or teeth or kitchen roll, whatever you like to call it. It's, yeah, that's, that's there, I think. So I'll put that one away. There. Right, take that bit off. Right, let's uh, buff this microcrystalline off. Right, so that's the inside finishing off. Finished off, I say. So we'll move on to the next stage. Well, anyway, I think we've got a long way to go with this, so, yeah. As you can see, right now I don't know if you can see that well, you can begin to see it there. I don't know if you can see it on the back one, I don't think you can. So, yeah, got a long way to go, so well, I'll come back when it's uh, snip when it's done. Ish. Oh, well, there you go some holes there and then I've got wavy lines going with the grain there that way that way that way and then back to holes a little, little bit couple of bits there I've missed fill them in Don't come out any good. I'll just uh, turn it down and make it into a normal bowl. Just got to get them fuzzies off. Right. So what I thought was, we'll do that. We'll do a black, then you sand it back, and then a plumb. So we'll turn this bead down. <coughs> right, let's see what that's covered like. It's covered in all the holes, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Lovely. We'll let that dry off. And then we'll uh, sand it back. I think that's all right. I think that's got it. Looks like it. I can't see anywhere that's not been black. Yep. Yeah, I do. Yeah, right, okay then. Take that dry off. Right, well there it is, it's drying out now, so. I'm hoping it stayed black in then, but I don't know, let's see what the, we've got.
don't know if it's sand off or not. Let's have a look. Wanting to go down a grip. Or two. Hmm, let's have a look. Uh, we've got a 320 out here. Probably not. 220. 240. Right, let's go back to a 240 then. Right, so what we got there now? Probably if I could get that down a bit more. Hmm. Does it need any more colour? I say to myself. Then that looks quite good as it is actually. Get a bit of Joe Sunyans on it. I think I'll leave that as it is. Looks good to me. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so what we do. You use the foam one, it's flat, but when it goes round, it's not putting it in, it's just putting it across the top. So we're going to do gold and violet uh, on that, um, a bit of violet, a bit of gold. Right, so let's just put it out there because you don't need a lot. That's it. Like that. Right, and then put it on. What we on? Oh, uh, very slow that day. brush over it yep good that's looking good <coughs> send it off and then um, put that the other way put it in reverse I can see what I'm doing better then. Right, so this that one. Gold. 
it. Oh. That's it, just mix it in, doesn't matter. I think that's come out rather well, he asked. Right. Right, the lacquer is a satin park side, so that's a, that's a little, isn't it? Yeah, I must have picked that up when I'm when I was walking there. So let's have a little bit of uh, stop it going down my throat. About 160. That's it. I can get the top off now if I can. Really? That's what it is, you see. I don't want you to I don't want you to use it. God, it's not for me. I know I'm getting old. But that's ridiculous. <laughs> what have I got I can get that off with? Pull the air across it. Right, okay, well, I'll let that dry off because, as I say, it's a satin finish, uh, not gloss, and probably take a while because it's not, you know, that warm in here. Uh, let's begin it to go. Tacky. Uh, I'll give it another coat and um, it should be probably. I'll give it another coat tonight when I come back from having my blood tests. And uh, we'll come back tomorrow and take the tenon off. But yeah, I'm liking the, liking the golden. Turquoise in there. Quite nice. Quite nice. Violet it was. I like it turquoise. It was violet. That's right. Bloody silly, silly boy, Pike. Well, welcome to another day. That's uh, as you can imagine, it's dried now, it's been overnight. It's still 
Hmm. Not quite dry. So I think that uh, that little one probably needs a little bit more temperature to dry. But anyway, it works. It's dry. It'll dry. It doesn't matter. It's not going anywhere, is it? Right. So all we've got to do then is uh, take the tenon off of it. I do think. Yes. Yeah. Well, you can see that or not. But you know the tenon's got to come off. But uh, I don't think you can see the different colours in it. I don't know if you can on that one or not. It doesn't do it justice, the light in here. But it's definitely, you can see the gold. And I'll take some photos of it when I've finished it and uh, put them on social media. Uh, uh, yeah. A little something a little bit different. Anyway, let's get that set up and ready to take the tenon off. So you know that I'm not going completely round the twist. Hang on. Sorry about that. Um, where was I? Oh yeah. See what we've got there. That's it. I'm well, I'm just undercut it a bit. Just gotta get that little ridge out. Stripping that tall rest is a bit too tight there. Just a bit better. Uh, do a little bit of sanding on it in there and then we can take the knobbly bit off right so I've uh, I have sanded the bottom off put a bit of polish on it just a well, wax on it just to finish it off. Uh, see if I can find side zoom. That'll do. That one. And we just got that final little bit to take off there. I've moved the control with the emergency stop on it, so it's by my leg. So if I have to stop it, I can.
Así. And that should, that's it, just roll away. Right, so, get that out of the way for a minute, so I can get that out of the way. Clean that bit off in a minute. All right, let's get this out of the way. That's it. Look down the end. Bring him over here. Turn him out. One draw. <coughs> See it really well, you can see it better there, but I will finish that bit off there. That is sand up, but you can just about see the different colors from me through it. God, my chest wheezing, God. right? So, you've got all the Joe Sonyas, they are on there. Yeah, quite a uh, pleased with that one. It's a little bit different, isn't it? Like normal bowl inside, but finished off quite nice. Let's be around these edges. Anyway, if you've enjoyed it, like and subscribe. It goes a long way to help my channel. And, uh, well, until the next one, bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye, guys and girls, I should say. Take care.